Oh well guys, there's a gun Adam from Basic Urban Cards and here I'm again with another card opening. Today we are finally doing some of this Footy Stars 2021 Prestige. These are pretty much the basic set, but with more numbered cards. They're pretty limited. Uh, when I pre-ordered these, they sold out pretty much instantly, but I managed to get some. Um, yeah, so we'll take a look at these. Um, they came in pretty quickly. Um, uh, we got 24 packs in a box, 8 cards per pack. Um, the best thing about these is it's about 1 in 3 box chance, roughly, of getting a, a marquee. So we've got way more of a chance of getting a marquee in this than we would normally. And plus I think they're numbered a little lower, so let's hope we get a good player if we do manage to get one. But... As always, um, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to chuck a subscribe and um, leave a like. It does help me. So we'll get straight into opening this box. I know I said straight into it, even though it's been probably about a minute. But let's go. I'm looking forward to opening these. The problem I have with these is that it's not much of a problem, really. Um, they don't make a specific folder for this set. So... Um, kind of sucks but we'll just have to try and get a one of the normal footy footy stars folders and put the cards in there if I can find one so we yeah, have about 24 packets here put them on the side here yeah hopefully they tell us the odds on the back yes they do we have the Game Breakers, 90 of them, 1 in 3, Red Parallels, Blue Parallels, and the Green Parallels are the ones we want. It'll be about 1 per box. Clearance Kings, 1 per box. Brownlow Leaders, 1 per 2 boxes. Brownlow Predictor, 1 per... Okay, so it's 288 packs. So the odds on getting a, a marquee are a little higher than I thought. But 288 packs is a lot that would be over 10 boxes so as you can tell with these cards a little dinged in the corner is it no okay we've got whitfield as you can tell the cards are all shiny zeagle i don't think he guaranteed so there's the first red card tim kelly how many of these per box Reds, there'll be a fair few of these in the box. So, um, that would be considered an insert. I don't think he guaranteed a full set per box. I think that's how it worked last year. To make you want to buy more than one box. I'd like to know what the box hit for this would be. Swallow, Gunston, Sarong. Can we get a game breaker? This one is a full parallel. So would these are numbered? They're not numbered. So I think they were one in three packs, if I remember correctly. Rewalt, Norton. I did open a box of these last year. Um, I think I've done quite alright. Um, I prefer the, obviously, the. Domination or dominance, sorry. They um you guaranteed an auto in one of those. Don't know if they'll do that this year. Okay, we've got another game breakers this time. We have Bulk from Port Adelaide. And Lynch Bulk again. Jones Rampin. We are hoping to get a marquee. It'll be super nice. But it's looking like the odds are just as bad as with the normal packs. So, 288 packs. Like I said, that's over 10 boxes. Just over. And nothing in this pack. This is dud pack. So you can get dud packs in this. 
you managed to open some of these and you got something good, make sure to leave it in the comment section. I do like to hear about people who watch my vids getting good stuff. So, okay, Harms, Yuniki, Mangola, King, and then we got a blue parallel of Jack Billings. Looks very nice. Is this one numbered? Yes, 44, 125. Put him in a sleeve. Usually sleeve up. Numbered cards if you watch my basketball openings. Put the reds at the end there. And the blues and then the green will go next to that. And the... And these packs are very flimsy. I don't think it really matters because most people who buy these will get them in boxes. Tui, May, Perryman, Shoal, I think this is a dud pack, Sheil, Neil, and Hill. Whirlpool. Atley, Crisp, and we've got another Game Breakers. This time it is Jake Lloyd. Edwards, Dixon, Hanbury, Hurley. Just some of these packs are gone in the way. Just drop them on the floor, I'll clean up later. Green, Brayshaw, Dangerfield, Casbolt, Cameron, Brown, Hearn, and Bontepelli. So another dud pack. Seems there's a lot of dud packs in this. So the inserts are pretty pretty light. You think they'd just put another one in so you could get an insert every pack. But I don't know whether that's just laziness or what. Okay, Thomas, Ryan. Side bottom, and then we've got another red Paddy Cripps. I don't know if these were numbered. Yeah, 44 of 210. So the red ones are numbered as well. Prestia, Kelly, and Rose. Rosie. Don't know how it's pronounced. I'm still learning the names. So you've got to give me a break. I learn a lot of names of Pokemon and players from many different sports. So you've got to. Gotta give me some leeway. I know if you say some player's name from someone's favourite team wrong, they'll crack it at you pretty bad. Okay, Clayton Oliver. Number 67 of 210. Cochin, Hing, Jones, and Steele. Getting pretty close to the halfway mark. No box hit. I don't even know if you guarantee the box here, honestly. I'm assuming that it would be. Haynes, Gone, Cunnington, Adams. We've got another game breaker, and this time it is Graham. Nice. Okay, we've got Heppel, Crouch, and Andrews. We have Martin, Guthrie, Day, Mundy, Johannesson, Martin, Gaff, and Buses. So we are officially halfway through, and nothing too impressive. One blue, which um, what we guaranteed. One in ten packs. So we should get roughly two per box and one green. Bows, Oliver, Dumont, and then we got a clearance Kings. I guess that is the box hit. Jed Anderson, that does look pretty awesome.
we go. That is numbered six of 120. Not sure if that's his number or not, but that is most likely a box hit. Just, yeah. Franklin, Sloan, and Azorko. We may get another thing, but probably not. Obviously, everyone wants to get. They don't get a player they want. They want to get Dustin Martin because he goes for a lot of money. Okay, we got another. Well, I don't think we got Rory Sloan yet, but we do have him. Now, anyway. Hill, Kennedy, Prestia, and Kelly. Did I say Kelly twice? No, I didn't. I said Kennedy. Thomas, Ryan, Sidebottom, Doherty. We've got another blue. This will be our second one. This time it is Toby Green of the Giants. Numbered 5 of 125. So it does say their numbers on the back. I don't know. Oh, on the front is it even. Sorry. <coughs> I don't know if I would say it on the back of this one. No, it does not. So I'll just have to hopefully see Anderson in one of the other ones. Tricky one. Okay. Sicily. Wits. Traka. Toronto. And we got another one of Rory Laird. Numbered 8 of 210. Well, at least we're getting some low numbered, numbered cards. I haven't been putting any of the red ones in sleeves until now. Smith, Butler, Papley. Hopper, oh, Walsh, Duncan, Noble, another one. This time it is Rowan Marshall. Merritt, Wollaston, Rockliffe. Let's stack these out of sight. Stack's getting pretty low. Okay. Collins, Mitchell, Wilson, Simpkin, English, Sheed, Lloyd, and O'Brien. We have three six packs left. Tarrant, Stewart, Maynard, and we have who's this? Liam Shields, Game Breakers, Lions, Walker, Gray, and Lambert. Five more. I think we're not getting anything better than that clearance, Kings, honestly. Okay, that pack is particularly munted. Weedering, Lob, Miller, Amira, Zacharakis, Yo, Billings, and Mills. Yep, four left. Just finally got our green on. Oh, God. Hey, Callan Ward, Viney, Scott, McKay, and then our green one is Kane Lambert. Numbered 57 of 60. Hmm. 
So that's probably the best card we're going to get, honestly. I don't think those clearance kings do it too well in the selling. Not that I'd sell it anyway, but you know what I mean. Now, if I got a dusty one, I'd probably sell it, but I'd be stupid not to. Okay, Josh Kelly, Langdon, Selwood. We've got another blue. Angus Brayshaw. Uh, thrown to the ground. Number 91 of 125. So, I guess if you get an average insert like this Clearance King, you'll probably get another blue instead, which is why they put the um, one in a 10. So, you have a chance to probably pull another good card. And uh, if you do, you won't get another blue. That's probably. Okay, Pendlebury, Walters, Harbrow, another Game Breakers. This time it is Stephen May. Stringer. Desma, Cooley, Ross. Last pack. Lucky flick. Hopefully, you just randomly get a good card in this. So that'd be nice. But no one our luck? Probably not. Liam Shields, Mears, Murphy, Jones. And we do. We get a 2020 Brownlow Leaders. Paddy Cripps, 10 Brownlow votes. I don't think he's going to be getting many votes this year. But I guess I do get two inserts. Paddy Cripps, 2020 Brownlow Leaders. Number 18 of 80. That's a pretty cool looking card. Put that one there. I guess that's probably the better card. And that was the last packet. So, for me, in this box, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight game breakers, one Brownlow leader, one green, one clearance king, three blues, and how many reds? Four reds. And I'll sleeve the rest of these up. I don't know why I didn't do that, but. Go straight into sleeving them up. So all in all, yeah, it's a pretty good box. Um, with these, you don't really open them to sell them. You open them purely for collecting. If you open them to sell the cards, that's pretty silly. You'd make more money, I think, uh, selling the box. Otherwise, you're just essentially gambling. With these ones, they're literally a hobby box. You open them to open them. But, um, yeah, with that will end the video um if you enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like um if you'd like to see more videos like this i will be probably having some more of these boxes um yeah chuck us a cheeky little subscribe if you did open a box and you got something good uh, or you didn't get something good just leave it in the comment section I'll, i would like to know what other people have been getting from them and um as always i hope to see you again next time thank you very much for watching bye Thank you.